Uh, what's going on, y'all? It's your boy J2 Cool. If y'all haven't already, man, hit that subscribe and that follow button. Y'all stay tuned to new videos that I'm dropping every week. So, um, you know, uh, as y'all may have seen in the uh, news lately, um, this uh, black family, I guess they were at this place called uh, Sesame Place. And, of course, two, you know, cute little black girls, you know, um, they were, you know, I guess they had some type of parade going or something like that. And, of course, you know, the Sesame Street costume or characters, they were approaching, I guess, the people on their side of the, the road or the street or whatever. And... They were reaching out, trying to get a hug, a handshake, just anything that they can do to get acknowledged. And, you know, the person in the costume basically just, you know, walked past them and just, you know, shook their hand like, nah, I don't want to, you know, acknowledge y'all and stuff like that. Well, throughout all that happening and, and everything, they have... uh and from what I read that the family is from Baltimore, you know, the Baltimore, uh, the family, um, they, you know, basically are suing for 25 million. And my thing is this, honestly, I don't blame them because if you are discriminating against little kids like that, you deserve to be sued because I'm going to tell you like this, as when you are in a profession like that, your job is to make sure when when each and every last one of them kids is down there, you got to make, because like I said, they ain't number kids. They ain't number kids, man. So when you do, when you have a bunch of kids down there, you have to think and realize, you know what, man? These kids are probably idolizing these Sesame Street characters. They probably watch them every morning. So when they down here, they want to get that, that feel and that thrill and say, you know what? You know what I'm saying? I just met my favorite Sesame Street uh, character. I, I, I can't believe that they shook my hand and, 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 they, and they took a picture with me and they did all this and that. But instead, the person behind the costume wanted to be a jackass and set up and, 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 and be discriminative toward these little kids, these little girls. And which end up, you know what I'm saying, turning into... A damn lawsuit. But you know what? It wouldn't be a goddamn lawsuit if you would have just did your job and not discriminated against those little girls when they haven't done nothing wrong, when they haven't done nothing wrong to you and they ain't nothing but some little kids. See, it's a lot of shit that a lot of companies can avoid if they just sit up here and do their job and make sure that they company is not discriminative towards people of color and just just discriminative towards people just as a whole. A lot of lawsuits can be avoided, but y'all sitting up here and letting these dumbass people work for y'all and don't even care to know what type of background they have or how their attitude is and how they carry themselves or none of that. Y'all just like to hire people, you know, just to hire people. and ain't even taking the time out to realize who you just sit up here added on to your roster of employees. And with that being said, you know what that's going to probably cost y'all? $25 million. And honestly, I don't, I don't even blame them for sitting up here soaring for $25 million. Because y'all should have realized who y'all was hiring and who y'all had to represent y'all company or y'all, you know, big building or whatever y'all may be located at. But this, but these are the consequences of when you be discriminative or you or you discriminate against a certain people because of how they skin color look. Like, I mean, like it, it, this is what happens. So honestly, I don't feel sorry for the company because, like I said, they knew what they should have been doing to make sure. That everybody at that at, at that at the Sesame Place that they was treated equally and treated fairly, but as y'all see, they want the case.